Hello! <sighs> Hello everybody, my name is Markiplier and welcome back to Subnautica. Now, I- I forgot that I spawned outside of my prawn suit and I just so happened to be in a dark, deep depth of... hell over here and everything is horrible and I hate everything and every- oh god. So, what I want to do is, uh, I need to get back to the surface! I want to get to safety, uh, first and foremost. That's more important than anything that I'm doing right now. But, uh, I, I have limited amount of food and water and actually I have no idea where I am because things seem so dark and dreary that I- I feel like I'm gonna get lost in the ether and never be able to find my home again. And that's entirely possible, but I need to get on the way back up and I need to do that in a hurry because I'm running out of food and water as I said before and that means that death is imminent and I have no hope and everything is horrible in front of me. So I'm gonna climb my way back out of here, and hopefully... Did I hear a voice?! Did... Did someone just say words to me, or am I going out of my goddamn mind? Because I'm pretty sure I'm going out of my goddamn mind. I'm fairly certain that that's exactly what's going on here. Hey, you are horrifying. Ooh. You wanna get ground? You seem beautiful and peaceful, but I know that guy's a dick over there, so... Maybe he's just your bad neighbor, but oh my god, look at you! Holy shit, what is with you? I mean, I'm not one to criticize, you're beautiful in your own way, but oh my god. Something's going horribly wrong with your body. I don't know how you survived down here, being the way you is. Gorgeous, admittedly, but, you know, just terrifying. Is that titanium? Is that titanium? Is that fucking titanium? Are you kidding me? Is that fucking titanium? Oh my god, that's fucking titanium! Holy shit, that's titanium! So there are titanium deposits out here that I can grind away! And it does two for one! Okay, but that's besides the point because I'm about to run out of everything. Good thing I got big filtered water. I'm a big boy with big filtered water and big dreams! So I'm gonna- I'm gonna make my way back. But I'm gonna go over this way because there's some- Bizarre structures over this way. There- that big tree, I can't make my way down there just yet. It is too deep down, and I'm not gonna be able to get there. So what I gotta do, is I gotta make my way. I gotta swing swung back up- oh shit. Come on, pull me! Pull me, baby! I gotta make my way back up this way. What is that? Have I seen that before? Nickel ore? Nickel back? Nickel ore? I've never even seen nickel ore before. Okay, so there's sulfur down here and there's nickel ore. Both two new things that I have not seen before, but I'm gonna try to gather. I didn't even notice that one. Zip zap zap and Spider-Man my way up. Zoom! Bip! Mm, ah! About to spear myself to death on those things. Hop! Okay, thank you. Man, I wouldn't be able to- Eh, you're a giant ver- Whoa, okay, bye then. Alright, see ya. Oh, that's a giant version of the crab things that are on the island. Whoa. Whoa! Whoa, this is a new area that I have not seen before. Holy shit! What the fuck? I don't have time to see this shit! Oh my god, I'm gonna eat one of you guys if you come near me, but I- I'm a little bit desperate, but this is- holy fuck. That is so weird. What is this place? This was right next to this, I mean, this is- This has gotta be related, some sort of- some sort of stuff that's- And what is this? Is this more nickel? Because it looks different than anything that I've seen before, but it might be something that I've seen, I'm not sure. Yep, that's a big deposit of nickel here. I don't know what good that's gonna do me, but I can't stay risk out of my suit. That was not English, and that was not good, but I can't risk staying out of my suit too long, or else I'm gonna get killed by the crab squids. I've literally only got one, uh, one hit left in me. If I get hit once, I'm dead. And that even means if I accidentally drift into the, into the brine. Which is entirely possible, but I don't wanna- I don't wanna risk it! Okay, that's all the nickel that I'm gonna get from that. Holy fuckerino. Jesus, look at this shit! What the hell? It's huge! This is fucking ginormous! I've never been down here! I didn't even know this existed! It's a whole nother section of the Lost River. There's still brine that's running through here. Or sulfur, I think what it actually is. It's not brine. Brine is just salt water, but- Oh my god, there's so many of those crab things and they're all staring at me. Ugh. Well, more titanium, but I don't need to worry about that right now. <laughs> Fucking shut up with you. Okay, then. I guess- I guess the only way to go is up, but I've never even known this was here. How could I have known? Uh, I don't have time to marvel at it. I'm gonna 
run out of food at any moment, and I'm hoping this is gonna loop back or at least loop out of this place. Maybe I can find another exit out of here, and then I'll- Oh, fuck, it's just you. And then I'll be able to go my own way. But it is disturbingly quiet down here. That's another thing that I'm gonna admit about this. It is unabashedly quiet, except for a few creatures hither and thither. Oh, hi, friend. You know what? God damn it, right as I find some sulfur, isn't it? Ain't that just the shit? Right as you come across some sulfur, the fucking warp repeal. Okay, bye then. Never mind, he heard me talking shit about him, and he decided to bugger on out of here. Good. He didn't want me to lay the smack down on him. If I get warped once, I'm probably gonna die. Yeesh. Whoa, sorry, sorry, sorry. Didn't mean to do that. Okay. Well, apparently I found the land of milk and honey when it comes to what I can only assume to be either gold or copper and then nickel, but right now, whoa. Oh! The blood trees! Or whatever they were. I'm not- I'm not entirely sure what they are exactly, but those weird, like, bulbous blood things. The weird trees down in the dark depths. Okay- Again, I- it's either a whale or a man screaming in pain! Maybe a man wailing in pain if I can be so bold, but ugh. Oh, what is that? Oh, jeez. Okay, well, this is horrifying, but I think this might have been one of the ways I also came into the Lost River before they actually built this out. Oh, that crab squid is not looking good. Also, he's clipping halfway through the bottom. That crab squid wasn't glowing spots of green before, so I'm assuming that the disease is coming at him. Hot and heavy. Don't even try me, buddy. Whoa, what the fuck? Whoa. Yee. Hey, come on now, you weren't so violent before. You were like my friend. Oh, jeez. I imagine that touching the electrocuting things ain't gonna be too good for me. Okay, so I gotta get out of here because I only got 22% health left. Fuck, I'm on the complete wrong side. All right, come on, time to spoder man out of here. We gotta go. We gotta go and find out what to do with this sulfur and nickel first. And then we're gonna write down some names on the- on the lockers and then we're gonna get out of here, but... We gotta get out of here first. Alive, preferably. Ay 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 ay. No, no you don't. No you don't. No you don't. No 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 no. No no, I don't have time for this bullshittery. I have- I usually have a lot of time allotted in my schedule for just general bullshittery, but I don't have time right now. Oh my god. Where am I? Ugh, that's just sinking into the darkness. Okay. Alright then. Not sure exactly where I am or where I ended up, but I am a ways away from where I needed to be. But that is just bizarre. Just this section right here that's just here. Why and how? Ah, shit, ah, shit, ah, shit. I'm falling, I'm falling, I'm falling, I'm falling. Please land on good land. That didn't sound good. Okay. I think we're okay, actually. I think we're in a good spot. I don't know where we are because it's pitch fucking black, but I think we're okay. Maybe. So I'm right here. I was so stressed for no reason. I'm literally right here. How in the fuck did I get- What are you- Are you dead? Must be? Question mark? Okay. Alright then, I'll eat you. Thank you for your contribution. So, there's an entrance to the Lost River literally adjacent to where the life pod is in the safe shallows. That is absurd. I honestly had no idea about that. That is crazy. Okay, but I gotta eat this thing right now. Right now! And I got a bonefish, too. I guess I could eat that, but... Habooski! And... Habooski! Okay, so now that I've got back to my thing, I have new materials with which to use, but I need to go all the way back to my base down below. I mean, I wish my sea moth could do what I needed it to do, but I think the next step that I need to do is build a cyclops. I need a mobile base that can go way down deep into the depths of the ocean while also being able to carry with me my prawn suit. And uh, I'll get to the lockers in just a second as soon as I get back to my base, but I'm gonna do some resource gathering before I do that. So, see you in a bit. Is that a diamond? Is that really just... Mercury ore? Wait, have I ever gotten mercury ore? Wait a minute. Cinnabar. Heat in O2 to acquire refined mercury. I don't know if I've ever gotten mercury ore before. I didn't even know there was mercury ore here. Have I gotten that? Have I never gotten mercury ore? How is that possible? I have no goddamn idea. 
I, I guess I've never just walked down on the bottom here. And I don't even know if I need mercury ore, but I seem to be gathering a lot of really rare materials. I don't even know if they're really rare. I'm gonna assume they're rare because I found them, and therefore that means they are rare! To me. But anyway, I found them, so I'm gonna gather them up as best I can and then take them somewhere. Lithium, yes please. I didn't even goddamn know! How did I not goddamn know? How could I be so dumb? He's a early hiddly diddly 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 Coming in hot and heavy Karen uh, Okay. Don't know why there was so much dirt on the top of my moon pool, but I ain't gonna question it. Alright, bubble butt, you come with me! Let me just see if Oh fuck, hi! What the fuck? Oh, okay! Uh, I'm gonna get in my base before you have time to fuck me over! Jesus Christ, why was that guy just there? Did he just- I didn't even see him warp in, he just appeared! The fuck was that about? No goddamn idea. Alright, anyway, I got a lot of rare materials, but what the fuck? That guy needs to learn some goddamn manners. Okay, so I got a lot of rare materials, hopefully he doesn't warm me out of my freaking base. Cause I don't think I have anything that I need for that. Alright, just gonna start dumping and I'll coordinate it later once I know that I'm not gonna die. At least I got plenty of power. Man, fuck that guy. Fuck that guy. Is that you moaning out there? Huh? Was it you moaning down in the deep depths? Huh? Is it because you have no friends because you're an asshole? I have a funny feeling like that might be the truth of the matter. At least it got big water here. Big, big water, baby. Big water. Sweet! All the water I could possibly need. Thank you very much, water filtration devices. I got my bioreactors all where that's not okay. Okay, that- I think that has to do with the weirdness of me deleting my, uh, my save game files, but it does seem to reduce some lag, so I think I can- I think I can deal with that. I think I could deal with a little creep into my- into my goddamn place here, but, you know, that's okay. Small price to pay, I suppose. Okay, so I'm gonna read some lockers now. I was able to get back to my base, and the warper is being really weird outside of my base. I don't know why, but I seem to be safe in here. Uh, Ninja Cat Caro 2 said you can dock your prawn suit in the Cyclops if you make one. And I didn't even know that I could do that. Uh, it's gonna be a bit of time before I'm able to make a Cyclops because I gotta go get enamel for enamel glass. I gotta go pry the teeth out of stalkers so that I can do that. Uh, then there was Robin Haddock's uh, who said, you need to build a second moon pool so Bumblebutt and Mr. Fister don't have to take turns keeping the warper's company. Uh, I'm starting to think there's only one warper! And it's just following me around like a douche, and I don't even know why he's doing that, but... Hopefully he's having fun being an asshole out in the middle of the goddamn ocean, but... I think just one moon pool is enough for now, I gotta conserve my resources. Uh, and then Scooter Max 2 who said, there's a total of four. Precursor bases, apparently. The quarantine enforcement platform, which is the big gun. Uh, the disease research facility, which is located in the Lost River. I imagine if I go just a little bit deeper and I'm able to upgrade my, um, uh, Mr. Fister to be able to go down there, uh, I'll be able to find that one and maybe that one uses the orange one, the orange key that I have. Uh, but there's also the precursor power generator, which is located within the lava castle, which is down in the active lava zone. And then finally, there is the primary containment facility which will eventually house the Sea Emperor and is found in the active lava zone and has several teleporters as well as a room with a deactivated warper. And there are other warpers there and other aggressive sea life will begin protecting you. And I have no idea what that means, but apparently that's later on and not implemented in the game just yet. So hopefully we'll be able to see that, but thank you Scoot Max for that information. Now, we need to... Fuck, we need to- uh fuck, I need to fill these things. Hang on one second, I need to get more- get more shit into these bad boys. I think there's no other way around it. There's one thing that I have to do above all else to be able to get farther in this game, and I think number one, primarily above anything else that I could do, I have to make a Cyclops. I just have to do it. There's no way around it. There's no way I'm gonna get farther in the game unless I right now dedicate myself to getting the resources necessary to be able to build that Cyclops. And it's not too hard. 
Plasteel ingot is fine. I've got enough titanium on me right now to be able to make that plasteel, and I have the lithium. The enabled glass, it's a bit of a bitch. You just gotta get the teeth from the stalkers. Lubricant's easy. Advanced wiring kit can do that. But I gotta go back to the other place to be able to do it. I've gotta go back to the dropship, and then I gotta go back to Billy Jeff Jeffrey, Billy, Samwise, and Marshall by the Aurora to be able to get that thing actually built. So, this is gonna take a lot of work. I need to go get the materials necessary. I've got enough that I'm gonna be able to do it. In fact, right now I'm just gonna make the titanium necessary to be able to do that. Because I've got it now. Why not? I can do it. It's cool. And everything's gonna be okay. But then I gotta go get the enameled glass and that's gonna take... I'm pretty sure you need to tame some stalkers to be able to do that. Even if I don't need to tame stalkers, I'm gonna go tame stalkers and see how that goes for me. I honestly have no idea how that's gonna go for me. I'm pretty sure it's gonna go very bad for me, but we shall see. So, I'm gonna do that. I'll be right back when I get to the stalker section of this endeavor, and hopefully I won't get my face bitten off. I will be able to get some glass and some teeth and just generally have a good time without being terrified and dead. In that order, because after I'm dead, I, I just, I'm just dead. Just a few of these for the road. Yum, 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 in my tum, tum, tum. All right, let's roll, baby! Let's roll. Hopefully we can get around to this warper. I should name that warper. I'm gonna call you Wallaby the Warper. Don't even think about coming after me, you big old bag of douche. Wilford? Wilford the Warper? I could call him Wilford. I'm gonna call him Wilford the Warper. Oh, Wilford the Warper. How about you go eat a bag of damn? All right, so the recipe to be able to tame a stopper is to have balls of steel and then a whole lot of peeper And then you just kind of like when it's coming after you you go ah, Eat it and not me eat this one eat it. Oh my god. I don't want to die eat this kill it instead of me and then hope for the best I think that's it anyway. I'm not 100 percent sure about it But maybe maybe that's exactly what you're supposed to be doing and then uh, you don't die And then it becomes your friend so long as you feed it more because that's how friendship works. You just keep feeding people until they like you, and then when you stop feeding them, they don't like you anymore and they don't want to be your friend, so. Life lessons from Markiplier. Keep your friends fed. And then keep them at a arm's length, distance, whatever. Alright, so step number one to imminent friendship. Gather peepers. Gather all the peepers that you could possibly gather. It doesn't matter if they're alive. Thank you. Call this fishing with bubble butt. Where'd you go? Where the fuck? You making a fool of me? Fine, I'll go find other peepers that want to play with me. <laughs> Sorry. Ow, fuck! God damn it, you were supposed to hit the peeper and not me! Fuck you. Alright, come here, peepers! There's a whole lot of you, huh? Oh, there's a lot of peepers. I just know that stalkers like peepers specifically. I don't know why, but they like them. Hey, you want a peeper? Hey, you want a peeper? Ugh. I have no idea how this is gonna go. Oh boy. Do you just like... Do you, I don't know. Do you just like... Say hi to him? Do you release it at him? Where'd they go? Did they fucking disappear? Where the fuck did they go? Oh, they're over there. Okay. Alright. Hey, uh, you want a peeper? I got a peeper for you. Nice fresh peepee. -pee. I'll trade you for that. Ooh. You want a peeper? <laughs> oh, oh, fuck. Ah! Fucking... You want a peeper? Huh? Fuck, fuck, peeper. Get peeper. Huh? Fucking stop. You want a peeper? Just take it! God damn it! I'll take this. Ugh. Man, this is scary. Okay. Alright. Hey, friend! Thanks for bringing me shit! Do you want this peeper? I'll take that. Okay. You want a peeper? Huh? Uh. Eat it! Oh shit. Oh my god. I think it's my friend! Oh my god, I think it's my friend! Ooh, I think it's my friend! I'm not 100% sure about this because I'm not very sure about anything, but I think it's my friend. You want a peeper? Oink. Eat it. Yeah, yeah. Eat it, eat it, eat it. No. You lost interest. God damn it. Oh, fuck off. I know! Damn it! Man, life was a lot harder when I had to worry about oxygen. Okay, so now that I tamed it, what do I do? Do I get. Fucking teeth from it? Give me your goddamn. It's afraid. Okay, I'll scan you, I guess. It's letting me scan you. Yeesh, these things are hard to scan. Boop. Okay, I got friends with the fucking stalker, I, I guess. Hey, you want one? Hey, you want one, buddy? I'm gonna watch. Oh man, you got a farm over here. 
I'll just take those, steal your shit. You want one? <laughs> Whoa, okay. Did it drop a tooth? I didn't see a tooth. No? One, okay. Fuck, what happened to all my peepers? What happened to a bunch of peepers? I could have thrown all my peepers at it, I had a bunch! Emergency. Ah, oh, fuck. I, gu I guess they're my friends now. I, I think. But they didn't give me what I wanted. But that's not how friendship works. I give you some, you give me what I want. That's how it's supposed to be anyway, I, th I think. You come back here, let me feed you a stalker. It's like you're afraid of death. Come on. What are you doing? Stop being such a douche. I've got nice juicy peeper for you. What the fuck? Whoa, fucking goddamn it. What's that thing? Ah, fucking goddamn it. Get the fuck off my arm. Stop, 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 stop. I've got other problems to deal with. God damn it. It's so hard. Oh, why is it gonna god give me a goddamn nightmare? How about you guys? You wanna you wanna bite my ass? Bite my ass. Bite my ass. Bite my ass. Bite it. Bite my ass. Don't don't I didn't think I'd have to shout that in the middle of the goddamn ocean. Bite my ass! All right, so that didn't quite work out, but then again, I always knew that was gonna be trouble. Getting the teeth from stalkers has always been my Achilles heel. I don't know what I'm doing wrong. I'll go look it up just in case it changed, but I got them to bite my sea moth. I got them to be my friend, but then again, it just didn't seem to be working out. I will look into this in the future and hopefully, hopefully, I will have an answer for you very soon, but just right now, I just, I got a lot of peepers in my pants and I don't have a lot of answers, but by the next episode I will have all the materials able, ready and able to build the Cyclops, because it shouldn't be too hard, so long as I'm able to get what I need to get. So I'm going to do exactly that. So thank you everybody so much for watching. Let me know how I'm doing down in the comments below. Thank you one and all for joining me on this epic adventure and cheering me on. I will build a Sema. Oh, I will build a Cyclops in the very next episode, and hopefully get you guys some more progress down in the deep, active lava zone. So thanks again, everybody, so much for watching, and as always, I will see you in the next video. Bye bye. Oh.